like to see the baby. This is the way. I can bring you in warm, or I can bring you in cold. I would like to see the baby. Long time no see, but not really. I saw you one. Couple strength plus. Yeah, all good. All good, thank you. Need to set myself right. How are you? I have got my hand high ground. I'm right about now. Um, what do I want to do? I don't want that. That's what I want. And I can find it. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you. But how are you doing, Grizzly? Are you well? Are you well? There we go. Oh! New art. December the 14th. New expansion. Ooh! <laughs> Yet another expansion. This game is definitely not dead. And I mean that not ironically, it's not dead because they just keep pushing it out. I don't know where they'll go from the story from here though. Because there's like three things going on right about now. You've got Darth Malgus kicking about. You've got... Um, you got the Mandalorians kicking out, and maybe... Yeah, the Emperor probably will come back again. Some way, somehow. Because they alluded to it, because one of the... Companions that joined... Um, whatever the fuck her name was... Uh, joined... And she... And um, one of them was dead and then came back to life. So... How have you been enjoying um, Skyrim Special Edition? I've really been enjoying it. The couple of times I've... Well, the one time I've gone on it. It was... Uh, it was interesting. Tell me about the new Dark Council. Still works more or less the same way, just less seats. The 12 organizations got merged into five. Still got one Sith on top of each of them. They run the Empire day Smashed to day. Smashed it a few times. 
been pretty stable since it was reformed. They're not all as yeah. quirky as Melora either. I want to do more strains. Like Krobos. All right. Yeah, well, I saw. I saw you were gonna do like a lot of mods. I think I'll do a vanilla playlist, and then I'll try and get some of the mods that I ran on my PS4. Try. But for now, I'll play with vanilla. But it's got, like, all the Creation Club stuff on it. So I get, like, backpacks and... And that new survival mode... Like, it's really interesting. I'm loving it. And the fishing. I love the fishing. I think I got everything. I think I got everything that was, um... I think I got everything with it, I think. There was a couple of quests I got. A couple of new quests. I don't know if they're, um... I think they'll have, like, voice lines from random people, won't they? Which I may or may not like. <laughs> I may or may not like. Uh... But <laughs> doing acting as a hobby, I become very critical of uh, really bad voice acting from community people in games. <laughs> I get very judgy. Bit hard to believe the old emperor was planning to eat us all. Guess we all owe you for that one, huh? So, you know, thanks for saving the galaxy and everyone I ever loved. Anyway, nothing on the scanner. We can keep moving. Nothing on the scanner. <laughs> but yeah, I'm really looking forward to it all. Um, my answer to that question is no. Um, it's never b really been a game franchise that's interested me. Um. I just feel like it's too long a game to put my time into. Um, Are non-human military officers common now? Getting there? I'm one of the first to get a rank like this, but the numbers are getting better every day. I had a bit of a head start when I was a slave. Yeah, I, was running ops I feel my master made his actual troops furious. He was a colonel in the infantry, special forces. Every mission he gave me, I ran circles around all um, the I don't know, I just Got feel like there's a lot. The there's happened? a lot in the Final Fantasy games. Frosty old Slimo's dead. Good riddance. They've just never... Not picking up anything here. Let's move there's on. just never... It, like, it's just... It, it kind of turns me off. The whole... How much there is in them. I don't know. It's hard to explain. I I just have problems with it. <laughs> but this expansion is kind of... It's the expansion they released last year? Oh, the MMO. I don't know. I feel like... Like... With Final Fantasy, the MMO, it just, it's not very appealing to me. I, d I don't know, maybe that's just because I don't like the other Final Fantasy games. Um, I don't know. It's just very odd. I, it just, it's like if you have a, you eat a piece of food and it doesn't matter how they cook it, you're not going to eat it ever again. That's how I feel with the Final Fantasy games. That's kind of a a better way of putting it. But I have been playing New World off stream. I don't mind New World. 
I think it's a little bit basic and it's in the early stages. But I feel like in a couple of years, it's really going to have some up. I feel. I feel it's very promising. And it's it's fun. I just feel that a lot, some of it is a little bit repetitive. But then again, when this game was released, and to be fair, a lot of this game does feel repetitive still. But at least there's story. With New World, it doesn't I feel like there's a lot of story. Our forces could finish this in a matter of hours. I'll bet they would. Uh, but we can't risk long-range comms. Jedi might pick it up. They hear a message like that, they'll clear out before we can do So this is the newer uh, newer so expansion. Nice to see a real assault force though. I kind of I really like this expansion that we're on. Um and then they're doing the new expansion on December the 14th, which will be fun. Um however, I will have to go on my original account to do it. Well, my my original Toon that I completed. So I'm not going to get this character there for a while. I'm told the war with Sakur was costly. What is the status of the Imperial military? Nowhere near the numbers we had in the old days. Just not enough materials and fuel and food to make it happen. Still a few steps ahead of the Republic, at least. We can thank Asina for that. She managed to rebuild a lot of warships without so cool knowing. Is that what Moff Pirate was up to? You'll have to ask him. <laughs> oh, we'd have to ask him. Still nothing. You know, I'm having a thought. Melora loaded the first wave of mutants on a shuttle, planning to drop them near the colony. They broke loose. Shuttle went down. Big surprise. It didn't go down far from here. We get the sensors on that bird working. We can scan a lot further. Oh, all right then. <laughs> But yeah, I'm also really looking forward to Halo Infinite. I really want to play that. I know the bite is out now, but I'm kind. I don't want to play the bite just yet. I don't know. I feel like I don't get enough out of biters. I prefer to wait for the whole game to come out and then experience it there so I've literally not watched anything purposely on it so I'm pretty much gonna be walking in blind I just know I know the basic stuff like oh the banished are back and some of the multiplier bits but I've purposely wanted to stay away but I, I definitely will be playing it when it gets released Definitely. Alright, need to find another Gian Ocean group. And Grizzly, I would also be happy, because I know they're not doing multiplayer campaign when it comes out until next year, until like March, March or May I think they said, I would be happy to do a couple of campaign playthroughs when that is an option, if you are interested. And even some multiplayer games as well. I definitely need to redo old days of playing multiplayer games. I'm probably not going to pre-order it. I'll probably just buy it off Steam when it comes. Well, I can't pre-order anything anyway. Well, I could pre-order off Steam, but... I would rather... I might pre-order it like on the day on my birthday, because my, because it Halo Infinite comes out a day after my birthday, so I might buy it on um, 
I might buy it on when it is my birthday and then oh shit pre-order it on that day and then it's ready for the next day then or at least it'll be ready for when I have a day off work what I'll probably do is I'll probably want to play through the campaign and then I'll I want to get into some multiplayer games if I can because hell yeah you really got some moves I'm not sure these geonotions are all that Melora makes them out to be. I'd love to watch you give her some feedback. Let's see now. Okay. Got him! That's Brax, all right. Let's get moving. <laughs> no, I can't be asked. <laughs> Fuck Brax. Def, I want to enjoy a Hylar campaign. And hopefully it's going to be ten times better than what Halo 5 spat out. <laughs> we can only help. We can only help. Fuck. I clocked on at the last second then. But then again, Halo 5 did make Hunters scary. I distinctly remember Hunters were scary in that game. But that was the only, only saving grace. I feel. I didn't even finish Halo 5 campaign, that's how bad it was. I played like the first couple of missions and got bored because I was playing a Cyrus team all the time and I wanted to play as Master Chief. I think I got through Master Chief's first mission and then a couple missions after that and that I just stopped then because it was boring me. Oh lovely. Been looking everywhere for you. Sorry, boss. Been quite a day. Looks like it isn't over yet either. More Geonotions. Ready if you are. <laughs> oh, I do love the Geonotions. Come here, babbies. Hello. Amplified Ossin Vindicator's boots. Wow, can't wait to never put them on. Why are they spawning so far away? Very odd. Gian Ocean Captain. Stake and a climb. Lovely. 
still in one piece, Sergeant? Not quite, Major, but close enough. Thanks for the save. Thank you both. Pardon, it's been a long day, but... Are you... Is that who I figured it is? <laughs> <laughs> Little Brooks ah, doesn't ah, think ah. he's worthy of a celebrity rescue. Such a weird day. Honor to meet you, Commander. I hope I've done more with my time today than save one grunt from a swarm of angry bugs. Braxy is probably my top scout. We'd be in a real mess without him. Hey, probably. So impress me, why don't you? Well, as a matter of fact, you know anything about a stealth supply drop coming in today? Nothing on the schedule. You saw one come in. I did. Landed near here. Was on my way there when the bugs pinned me down. Oh, wow. Anything more on your way to is a Bacta tank. We'll check out the supply drop site. You up for a bit more action, Commander? What kind of supplies are you expecting? Wasn't expecting any. My eyes on this character are so weird. They just move all the time. Look at them. They don't fit his eyes properly either. They're always You're clipping right, through his wait, skull. We'll see you back in camp. Much obliged. There's no. reputation points on this. One there. I didn't realise that. Oh, there is like extra stuff here, but it's all shit. <laughs> what the fuck? Bag of artifact gifts. Oh, well, you can have some of these then. God, I need to sell stuff. Really badly named Soul Store. There's so much shit on this character. Burn Jedi farms and buildings. Oh, you can do that. Oh, you can do that. I really like this expansion. It's um it's a really good story. Until we get to the part where the Emperor has returned again. It's a little bit silly by that point. <laughs> oh, the Emperor has returned for the seventh time. The Geos didn't have this uh, these soundtracks before. <laughs> Planting bomb.
Oh, that's on fire. Is that another thing that we can set on fire up here? It is. Ah. Expected to find real working farms here. Wonder how they're managing to grow anything in soil this bad. I didn't take you for a farmer. More of a gardener. Flowers mainly. You're joking. Keep that sunny disposition. I might even send you a few. That's two. they found soil reclamators that could handle a job like this. Jedi must have brought a few engineers along. Well, I wish, but I can't fucking see anything. That's some more. Is it weird that this is making me hungry? Why? Why is... <laughs> what? No, you high. I mean, if I jump up here, I'll get a... a better view. Let's try again. This has not helped. Oh, wait, hang on. There's one over there, but I can't hit it. Try. Really, bitch? Well, now there's one back here. Maybe if I try from here, might be able to see one that I'm not clocking. Seeing any. Try standing on here, see if we can get anything. I think there might be one down that, yeah. Starting to pick up a lot of chatter on the Jedi channels. Looks like it's coming from the other side of the farm. Let's check over there. The other side of the farm? That don't be right. What the fuck? Say so farmers talk. My stomach. It's because I'm sat at like a really weird angle. Hello, I am here to help you party. It's nice.
Fuck you. Oh, I up, duck. Be nice uh, to do my uh, Imperial Agent. I might have to um, say that. Dummy. Yeah. Um. I don't think I'm excited for anything else, really. Can you open it? Nothing in the works. Mm, doesn't look like it. There's the Lego my games. There's a couple of Lego games, games I want to play. Gonna have to be Melora. Speaking of. We should try to convince her to let us make a play for the Jedi's farming data. If the Jedi could grow food here, they could grow it anywhere. We nab their data and wipe their computers, that could be us instead. We grow more food, we feed more soldiers, we win more battles. Huge advantage. I couldn't agree more. We'll gather what the Jedi have learned, then make sure they can't use it. I'm seeing why you're so popular, Commander. Let's call in a speeder, get this thing back to camp. No, I'm not ready. No worries, Grizzly. No worries. What the fuck? There was... <laughs> there was loot! I didn't order any supply drop. I don't like this. Not one bit. It's a trick. Another distraction. Something sent by a rival. Someone trying to undermine the operation. I won't fall for it. So you're not just stupid, but paranoid too. Only a fool assumes no one wants them dead. No, no, no one is going to open this pod. No one is going to touch this pod. The operation is well underway. Your super soldiers are out of control. A minor setback that I have already overcome. I have formulated a mutative virus that will alter the Geonosian's olfactory membranes and adrenal cortices, making them susceptible to pheromone intervention. We need only infect the Geonosian queen and her six broodmates with my custom viral strains. That will spread the changes throughout their population. Mm. Of course, accessing the queen's chambers will be a challenge. Suicidal even, if her three bodyguard drones aren't killed first. Oh, heck. <laughs> no. It's impossible. <laughs> you died. He's big daddy. I am Darth Malgus. I speak with the full power of the Sith Empire. And I am in command now. I wasn't expecting you to be a part of this operation. I trust you share our goal. The complete eradication of all Jedi on this planet. I think this operation would be better off with me running things. These are Imperial troops operating an Imperial base. They are not yours to command. Too much time has been wasted already. We will begin by blinding and silencing our enemy. Who is the ranking military officer? Here, my lord. Major Anri. 
All Jedi communications and sensors must be jammed before we attack. Take as many soldiers as you need to complete this task. I'll only need one person to get that job done. Commander, would you be so kind? I'd be glad to do something useful so that Malgus can focus on his posturing. I'll be assessing the progress made before my arrival. I'm sure, with your help, it was extensive. And on that note, ready when you are, Commander. Why, you think because you tower over me, that gives you some kind of authority? Great. Um, if there is a droid of some description, I would be much obliged. Reputation vendor. Oh, let's have a look what the reputation vendor's got. Oh, I'm pretty well stocked up. There we go. For the <clears throat> um, this is the lot of it. Oh, for the alliance. a lot of it. Oh. Fool the Alliance. I just want to have a look, really, mate. Good hunting. That's the Minister of Logistics is making sure the war effort is well supplied. For the Empire. No, not brilliant. Not brilliant. Must have worked crystal. Surely at about the twenty. I'm good. Okay, not to die. Thank you. Um Do, 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 do. At your service, my lord. Travel route is confirmed.
Uh, is this game free to play? Yes, it is. Uh, but you are limited to what you can do as free to play. Uh, I can't remember the specifics, uh, but I think it's a little bit of reduced leveling. Um, but it, you can you can play a lot of the story for free. Um, it's only really the latest expansions that are um, preferred or subscriber only. But yes, it is overall a free to play game. Yes, welcome to the stream. I hope you are well and all of that. Oh dear, oh dear me. Right. Signal jammers are up here, I think. Uh, great likes, thank you for the follow as well. Um, I hope you're doing well. First you, now Malgus. This planet's turned into a real hot spot for the big to-dos. Should have worn my dressier armor. Did you know Malgus was alive? Nah, there were always people saying he was, but I never gave him much credence. They said he was the new Empire's wrath, a shadowy monster out killing all the traitors and cowards. So brush your teeth and eat your vegetables, that kind of stuff. Guess it was true after all. Yes, yeah, so as you can see, uh, we are playing a Sith Warrior, uh, I've the Juggernaut class, but um, what specialization am I? I think I'm Rage, Rage specialization. What do you mean? When Malgus showed up, two powerful Sith, both used to calling the shots, wasn't often end pretty. Hell, look what happened to Melora. Compromise isn't the Sith way. Can't speak to that. It meant a lot to the troops, so we worked together to get the job done. Yeah. Are you new to the game, or have you played it at work? Ah, you're at work. <laughs> so watching some streams. Well, can't blame you for that. Cannot blame you for that. Ah, yeah, it's a very different game from when it uh, when it was released. Very different game. Raven to nest. Blackout complete. Nest here. Copy that. Be advised. Spotters I beat some enemy forces near your position. They might try to shut down the jammers. Good thing I've got you to back me up. Raven to nest. We'll handle them. Raven out. Uh, oh. I've got a pending quest here. Alright, 
let's uh, tank all this off. 247. Don't think there's a, anything good on that. No. Oh, that's 326. Sorry. Yeah, very different game when it was uh, first released, this one. It's gone through uh, a lot of changes. I feel it's it's more focused on single player than it used to be. When it first started, it was more for MMO. Um, but it's a lot more focused on single player and story now. Which is nice. I, I like that. Um, but yeah. There's still, like, a, a lot of um, multiplayer stuff in there. It's just the game's kind of shifted towards single-player, really. But, I mean, you can still do, like, stories with friends and all that stuff. You've still got, like, huge, like, operations that you need, like, a guild for. But most of the expansions are now focused on single-player, like... Oh, yes. While I'm here... Let's just say, 341... 341 338, this is 336 isn't it, yeah That doesn't matter 347 348 333 So the only one we can put it in is this one There we go Yeah, it's. St I'd say it's still a very enjoyable game to play. Ah, I went the wrong way. <laughs> Where is it then? Or did I go the wrong way? I did go the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, uh, what we're currently doing at the moment is um, very late game stuff that's only for subscribers and that. Um, So this is more the expansion that was released last year, I think. around them because I can't be asked to fight them. Just need to check something quick. Oh. 
Never mind, man. Accidentally double quick, quick, double click and uh, move Where am I going? Defeat all right. Six. Electronets. We've got to keep moving, or we'll get pinned down and burnt to a crisp. Pretty sure I can, or maybe I can't. He's running a targeting calculation. Ow, Disrupt ow, it, ow, or we'll ow. be swimming in missiles. That hurts. Weird. <laughs> General Day Room. Don't Looks think like we you can shut their sensors down from there. Talk to him. I'm gonna do a quick sweep. See if you can't find a copy of their farming data while you're at it. Data received. I'm now infiltrating the Jedi computer system. All data on their crop and soil rejuvenation programs will be copied and then deleted. You have served the Lovely. Empire well. Congratulations, Commander. Are we set? Raven to nest. Job's done. Enemy is dark. Excellent. All units are prepared. We have traced the bulk of the Jedi to an ancient library. That is our objective. Coordinates received. We'll meet you there. For the Empire. For the Empire. The whole reason I accepted this pitiful assignment. You survived. I never would have made the Dark Council if a little shove were enough to kill me. What's so special about the library? Knowledge. <laughs> Research and documentation of long forgotten techniques gathered from both the Sith and the Jedi. Not to worry. I won't stand in your way. Complete the mission. I will simply pick over the remains for what I seek. You aren't even going to try to stand up to Margus. How did someone like you get onto the Dark Council? When you study the creatures of the galaxy as I have, you come to learn that there is always a bigger fish. Get uh -huh. on with your work. Pretty cool notice, reference. Empress Asina may have Malgus on a leash, but that does not make her the only one who can pull it. Strange lady, that one. Any luck with the farming data? I found everything we need. I've already sent it to Imperial Command. Outstanding. You don't know what a difference this is going to make. Reps will be too busy fighting for scraps to fight us. All right, time to hit the library. I swear, you can kill her. 
Oh well. Uh, a close one there. <laughs> um, I don't know, I just dislike them, you know, don't like their policies, you know, just don't like them, <laughs> just get on my nerves really, I'm just a bit too goody two shoes for my liking, I guess that's why, fascists, yeah, we, yeah, <laughs> Down with the bourgeoisie. <laughs> oh, okay. What? Hi, Red. How are you? And also, Fat Man. Welcome to the stream. I uh, hope you're doing well. Uh, despite my hatred for the Republic. Jesus Christ. I don't know what it is, but for some reason, whenever some, whenever Facebook posts anything, it's like it deafens my ears. Yeah, everything is good. A little bit stressed, and the reason why I'm stressed is because of this theatre production. Uh, it's a Christmas comedy. Um, it's called A Kick in the Baubles. Um, it's the first show, it's the first show we've ever done that is, that has sold out. It, we've nearly sold all the tickets for it. Incoming. It's insane. Um, so it's a lot more pressure than we're usually used to. Luckily, my part in this one isn't that big. So I'm not, like, panicking. Um, so, I, if it was, give us a taste of <laughs> what of my part. Um, my part's not even funny. My part's the most boring character. Character is so boring in this one. Um, here, you are, let me. Um, here, you are, I'll go through my lines. Uh, pleased to meet you, uh, Miss Bailey. Uh, Jean. Um, oh, I'm completely lost my lines now. <laughs> <laughs> this is going great. Uh, pleased to meet you, Miss Bailey. Uh, Jean. Uh, how do you do? This is my auntie Dorian. How do you do? Uh, do you want a drink? Oh, I could kill for a beer. But I, I'm not funny. Like my character is not funny at all. <laughs> I just basically have to play myself, a nervous wreck. <laughs> Here he is, big fatty Malgus. Come on. Major Anri. What's your plan? Um, yeah, Feta is very tense. A proposition. You came to Osis to aid our mission. As the galaxy marches to war, you fight to see our empire triumph over its ancient enemies. Um, together, you and I can I can go, I can try and go empire. through my line, so, we yeah, I, I could kill for a bit. Um, and then she goes off. We will show the galaxy that no um, I, I hear you work with asylum seekers, don't you? Justice yeah. Uh, do you give them condoms? The what? You heard, do you give them condoms? Well, not, not personally, no. <laughs> These are some of the lines. These are some of the lines that are in the show. Major, take the rest of the troops and sweep the building. Eradicate all who oppose you. Yeah, <laughs> it's 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 such a funny show. It is such a funny show. I 
thing is, I would offer, I would gladly offer, but like, I live in the complete middle of nowhere. And most of the tickets are sold out as well, mate. Um, my Darth Malgus is so overpowered. Thing is, we're gonna have to fight him as well. They give you this whole thing of, oh, look, this is, um, this is what it's like to fight Darth Malgus, except, um, he's on your side. Oh, yeah, for now we have him as a companion. Why is he taking his finger off? Why have they taken his hood off? That usually doesn't happen in this area. Um, find a way past the door. I think it's on one of these back ones. Or did it shut down? I think it shut down, didn't it? I'll get rid of them, because... Help the troops. Support our troops. He just pulls everyone towards him as well. Alright, now I've got to spend half an hour trying to find... Oh, hello. Oh, they're all rubbish. Yeah, um... Ah, there it is. But yeah, it's such a funny show. The thing is, like, um... I did a show back before the pandemic. I think it was about four years ago now. Which sounds crazy to say, oh, four years ago. Um... Because I forget we have pretty much missed two because of a pandemic. Like, show-wise. Um... And it was literally 90 pages. Now, the play was like about 110, 110 pages. And I was talking. I was the main character and I was talking for at least 90% of the show. It was so stressful. Oh, that's dead. It was so, it was so stressful. But yeah. I feel like if I had a big show coming off a pandemic and not acting for two years, if I had a big part, I'd really be stressing. Um, luckily, that's not an option. So... Do I do voice acting? Um, I can do impressions uh, but I've never I only do like physical acting um, at the moment just as a hobby not for like a career interest or anything like that it's just a bit of fun go on stage the thing is right this is the dumb thing about me, right? I love... I love rehearsing. I love acting. I hate performing. <laughs> so... <laughs> give an impression. Um, oh, hello. Um, yeah, I can uh, do an impression. Uh, so, see, the thing about doing impressions is... The ability to go from one impression and then go into another impression like this and all it is really is it's just a contraction of your voice muscles and then basically you just walk from one voice right to another and it's just as simple as that really but there you go <laughs> it's a weird talent I have is just to change accents on a whim It's 
saw an explosive canister here. Oh. oh! I could have blown up the door. That would have probably been more fun. <laughs> oh, oh, hello, everyone. Wait right until Darth Malgus does his dry and everything. Um, I can have a go. In any specific voice? Any specific voice or just a voice of my choosing? I feel like I could try and do an Emperor Palpatine impression with that. as Vader. I probably can't do a Vader impression because it's too deep for me. I can try a... I can have a go at, um... Palpatine. You do not know the power of the dark side. Ah, uh, Jar Jar Binks. I miss a Jar Jar Binks. Oh, horrible, horrible. Alright, Yoda. Uh, let's have a go. Mm. Mm. <laughs> do or do not. There is no try. Jar Jar Binks is kind of easy to do. Miss a Jar Jar Binks. Speak broken, you must. Yeah, I do pride. <laughs> Backwards all words must be. <laughs> Can do a golem impression as well. Love, love, love. The precious. Golem, golem. I pride she myself on some of them. It's funny because a golem impression is same as uh, well. a stitch impression as well. How? The sudden shift to more it's the same thing. <laughs> And you must be the commander of the Alliance. Ultimate Structure of sentence and coherent it is. A story I would mm -hmm. love to document. A pity that two such influential leaders would waste their potential by traveling here just to burn some old books and kill an old man. We're here to root out all of the Jedi. Didn't you hear the scream? Only the weak choose fear as their weapon. Oh, he's going to use his magic hands. <laughs> respective legends. So be it, Jedi. Let's begin. We are all shaped by the choices of our past. Nostral is a master of mind tricks. Do not. Oh no! It's Darth Barris back from the grave. I can't. More. Well, they're doing damage, Malgus. <laughs> they're pretty good illusions. <laughs> Our story isn't over yet. You, what, huh? Ow! Motherfucker! Yeah.
I would like to be able to do a Vader impression. Unfortunately, I can't. It's too deep. Any any very very deep voices, it just doesn't sound right when I try and do them. Oh, Barris is back. Hello, Barris. Get up, Faddy Malgus, please, I need you. And here he is. Ben Zalo. Norman Carr. Darth Barras. Tenebrae. It seems I'll be meeting my fate in distinguished company. Left to me, this library will be your grave, Jedi. But your fate is in the commander's hands. I'd say you have the right idea. Kill him before he bores us to death with another lecture. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> we finished here. Rally the surviving troops outside. Yes, my lord. Yeah, there's a lot of voices I, I can do, really. Very odd. Very odd. I don't know how. It's just got really uncanny ability. Oh no, they're attacking our base. We're under attack. Horus, they're attacking the camp. Major, all troops, return to base at once. And why is that one just walking? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Our losses, Major. We lost a lot of equipment, some gear and supplies, several of our troops stationed on lookout, but it could have been much, much worse. Then we stand our ground. We have won a great victory today. This trifling attack will not chase us away. Good. <laughs> Major, see that images of Nostral's corpse are transmitted to the enemy. I, my lord, Commander. Thank you for everything. It's been a real. Long hey, time. welcome back, Grizzly. I'm so glad. Get moving, Major. Yeah, right away. <laughs> I'm such a dick to everyone in this game. Ah, oh, I love it. Yeah, whatever, go away. <laughs> My lord, incoming broadcast from Empress Asina. Choke this man out. Malgus. I'm told you've completed your task in customarily ruthless fashion. We have slain countless Jedi, including the overseer of this colony, Nos Dural. His loss will cut our enemies deeply. Impressive work indeed. Faddy Malgus. But I've learned of an equally fascinating opportunity. Though it appears to have escaped your notice, the Jedi successfully raised new. Go big dick or go home. <laughs> big dick. There could have been seized and applied to generate plentiful food for our troops in this time of severe shortages. 
Unfortunately, the Alliance commander was more attentive and captured the data from the Jedi computers. Well done, Commander. You've ensured a strong Imperial military for years to come. I'm Yay! I could be of service, Empress. And what of the remaining Jedi, Empress? Our ships have detected shuttles evacuating in droves. They will intercept as many as possible, and we will leave a meager force to protect against further incursions. Your mission on Osus is over. Return to me at once, so that we may prepare you for your next assignment. Hmm. Commander. Malgus is on a bit of a leash. Always deeply appreciated. The Sith Empire is made stronger by its ties to your alliance. Our renewed war against the Republic has only just begun. But I am certain that you will become our greatest asset in the battles to come. I <coughs> do good, look like well, well. a good assignment. <laughs> I must prepare to depart immediately. Well, bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> Today, we began a war. One that I've already fought twice. Twice our empire has set the galaxy ablaze. Twice we have tried to burn away the hypocrisies and weaknesses of the Republic and their Jedi. Twice we have failed. Oh, our. We must not fail again, Commander. For there is precious little tinder left to keep our fire burning. Farewell. Oh, look at that power stance I'm, I'm using. Four. He has to know he's evil. Yeah. <laughs> Black and red. <laughs> we are, we're 100% evil, but we're loyal to our... Your new empire! Alright, mate with your alliance leaders. Well, uh, there's an easy way of doing that. Oh, hello. Um, feel the wrath. Oh, here we are. Uh, travel. Do this one. Because this is one of our companions. Oh god. <laughs> ah. It's in the next room. <laughs> Here we go. To my phone room, where everything is destroyed. Look at this, it's disgusting. No one's even fixed it. Commander, we captured this one slaughtering Alliance soldiers on Iokath. She nearly killed me before we subdued her. Oh my, oh my god, it's Jason who's got a massive forehead. I'll take it from here. Our apprentice, your forehead has grown. Please be careful. I don't like what I sense from her. So that's the famous Lana Benico. She's a weakling. I would have liked watching her die. You better have a flawless reason for attacking my people, Jaser. As if I need to justify myself to you after what you've done. What? When you disappeared, I pretended to feel nothing, but I was devastated. 
You were the only thing I cared about. It took everything I had to accept your death and move on. And then six years later, I turn on the hollow net and see you. No, Alive. she did have a big crush on us, but we denied her. Now you crave that power for yourself. You still don't understand. You abandoned me. You let me believe you were dead so you could build an empire without me. I would have followed you to the ends of the galaxy. Guess that didn't mean much to you. I no. just wanted to hurt you like you hurt me. So go ahead and punish me, master. You know I deserve it. You killed my people and threatened my advisor. I'll give you the dignity of one <laughs> fight. Come here, Jaisa. Fucking hell! Like that? Still so much weaker than you. You knew you wouldn't survive. <laughs> nah, ma'am. Fam, fuck your forehead. Maybe this was what I really wanted. <laughs> Die, Jason. Nah, fam, fuck your forehead. Lana, send someone to take care of this. We're finished here. It it was clearly trivial. I had no love for Jaisa. She attacked my power base. She dies. I don't care. I do not care. I thought that was a corpse then. How dare she. Fucking beesh. Fucking beesh. <laughs> nope. Oh no, we they're not important companions anymore. That's why you get to kill them off. <laughs> we have killed off so many companions already. All they do is, like, give a little bit of dialogue in some stories, like, Hello! I'm here! But I kill them all anyway. We have, like, seriously just killed, like, so many companions. It's so funny. She did. She had a. M she, like, if you look at my other playthroughs, her forehead was not Eternal that massive. Solid. I've caught two Republic spies since Osis. Both were disguised as cargo pilots seeking work. Unfortunately, they fled before they could be. Yeah, I think it was just that hood. I think it broke her. <laughs> broke her and broke her heart. Don't stop looking just because you found a few spies. Being discovered might have been their mission all along. Decoys to make us feel like we've won. It's certainly possible. I'll double our efforts. I've gathered intelligence from Theron's assets as best as I can. Uh, we have reports from most of the major conflict zones, which I forwarded to Bay One. My people are using that intel to create new write-ups for the major field commanders on both sides. Should help us predict strategic probabilities going forward. <laughs> <laughs> it's a cat man. I've deployed our fleet in a defensive uh, Don't worry, you won't be saying him for long. There's uh, one other matter we should discuss now that you're aligned with the Empire again. We've accomplished a lot here. I'm proud to have worked under your command. <laughs> it's a Khajiit. Now it's a better place. 
but I'm also proud of my past. I served the Republic for years. I can't fight them, so I'm retiring. Yep, see ya. I told ya. I told you, he's, we're not going to see him for long. He's going now. <laughs> he is leaving. Lana's already vetted her, and I'll stick around long enough to get her up to speed. Lana, I want security posted at all times to keep him from revealing any secrets to his Republic friends. As you wish. Nothing so dramatic occurring in our science lab. Improvements to Odessa's planetary shields have been successfully completed. All right, Hilo. We've had to step up security for my crews. Pirates yes, he's a, a doctor. Hut. <laughs> Lucky for us, you're friends with Mandalore. Now that word spread that her people are riding along, nobody messes with our transports. Good to hear. Anything else? Well, they're all fat anyway, so... ...construction efforts on Voss, so I believe we're finished. Good. Let's get back to work. There was one final matter for you. Lord Izar, a representative of the Imperial Outreach Division, has asked to speak with you. I've loaded his frequency into your holocom. There he is. There goes the... <laughs> there goes the thick boy. When will you kill Le Lana? Nah, I th there isn't ever been an option to kill her. We killed our other advisor. <laughs> We're killing everyone. Yep, she's cool with it. For Six now. Commander. So good of you to contact me. How can I help you exactly? I sir. <laughs> I kill everyone I get a chance to. I seek out opportunities to inspire greatness among our noble frontline soldiers. Darth Krovos is giving a speech to our forces gathered at Viken Space Dock in preparation for their deployment. This could be an opportunity to say a few words of your own. Your actions have made you a living legend after all. Certainty of victory inspires confidence. Hearing that you are out there fighting the same fight they are will undoubtedly instill that confidence in our troops. <laughs> oh, clearly. Fine, but this had better be fast. Oh, even a handful of words from a dead... No, he... anyone fails, they die. We shall await your arrival with bated breath. Safe travel. We literally had a mission, like, a, a month ago. Did you set up this speech to where someone left. Now, no, someone disobeyed my order, so I killed them for it. This is an excellent opportunity to inspire confidence in the Empire's troops. Inspire you can't run from me. <laughs> above baseline. Speak well, and victory will follow. I think what my next, um... character is going to do is basically because uh, it's an Imperial agent is going to go undercover oh the fleet there we go so I'm going to go undercover on because you can play the Republic side but I can sabotage them so I think that's what I'm going to do for my next one than those of the Republic. Oh, Rat Ghoul Plague's back out. Oh, there he is. Perfect timing, Commander. Darth Krovos is just finishing up. Follow me. I can sense the strength in each and every one of you. The passion for victory, and the power to achieve it. Watch us give, like, the most brutal fucking speech. At the speech. muzzles of your blasters, at the points of your blades, 
Our ancient enemies shall finally be destroyed. For the Empire! For the Empire! Oh. 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 Victory is within our grasp. Assuming we will succeed is an excellent way to ensure that we fail. Your caution does you credit. They're all yours. Here we are. Let's give the most oppressive speech in the history of man. <laughs> Um, so basically, there's Imperial Traditions. Oh, no worries, Red. D don't worry about it. <laughs> I know you're here in spirit. Courage, reform, and equality. Fuck that. Speak of war and victory. That sounds like my character. Darth Krovos spoke the truth. Victory over the Republic is inevitable. The Republic is weak and cowardly. They will never be able to stand against us. You are soldiers of the Sith Empire, the greatest army to ever march across the galaxy. Oh, I know. I know you are. Take up your I very much appreciate it. The of battle and win for the Sith Empire. To your ships. I just love hearing the like walking animation. Like a fine weapon. A bit simplistic, perhaps, but clearly. Mate, do not make me fucking choke you. Your time, Commander. I look forward to working with you again someday soon. I have killed people for less. We don't hear from NRO2 after this, I think. There we go. Onslaught! Love this. Love this. Oh, I'm going to have to skip this before I get copyright strict. There we go. La 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 la. Thank you. Isn't it beautiful? It won't matter. <laughs> this one is mine. Target destroyed. Another kill, and another step closer to victory. Let's regroup. Commander. <coughs> Your assistance with the 38th Fleet's operations has been exemplary, but I am now recalling them for a special assignment. Empress Asina invites you to join a special meeting of the Dark Council aboard Viking Space Dock. Oh, wow. We will discuss the details of the operation there. I am told the Council looks forward to hearing your voice among them once more. I've never cared much for the council. 
I have learned to appreciate its usefulness when properly <coughs> directed. I don't think he likes the council either. Marga's out. I might do. I don't know. I can the get. Complex, oh. A state of the art Republic shipyard. It nears completion on the planet Corellia. My spies report that it can produce ships faster than any of our shipyards and at half the energy cost. That hardly seems possible. Based on the technical readouts Zarian has acquired, I assure you it is entirely possible. Perhaps it is even a conservative estimate. Malgus. Mm. Krobos. Your plan for destroying this facility? By securing our frontline positions and withdrawing all but the most crucial warships, we have formed an assault armada of unrivaled size and power. Under our command, this mighty fleet will burn the Republic's new shipyard to ash and destroy <coughs> any hope of victory that might remain among their people. Is the shipyard your only target? Do you have plans for the rest of the planet? We may pursue additional targets of opportunity, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. We have gathered enough fuel ships to carry our fleet to Corellia without stopping. Our enemies are in no such position. The Republic Ward. will scramble reinforcements from all corners of the galaxy. Wherever they stop to resupply, we must disable or destroy them. We have already identified one likely refueling point for the Republic ships. The planet Onderon. Conveniently, oh. I am already engaged in operations to undermine Republic control of that planet. However, my forces are meager, to say the least. But with the aid of the Alliance and its commander, I am confident that I can successfully delay any Republic reinforcements that pass by. Your predecessor wasn't the most focused ally. I hope you do better. I'm confident that we'll work well together. Excellent. Keep your spies in place, Sharian. We must know everything about the shipyard and its defenses. Anathel, Varon, be ready to provide any assistance that Malgos or Krovos should request. This operation is the mm. Empire's top priority. Understood. My logistical networks are entirely at their disposal, Empress. Then this meeting is complete. I'm not gonna bow. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> I am my own man. Commander, fancy meeting you here. Major Andre, are you joining the mission on Onderon? Nah, I pulled off Aaron's operation this time. We're headed for some mined out rock called Mekshar, but word is we might catch up groundside on Corellia. Get on with your mission. I have places to be. <laughs> Whatever you say. Major and <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> to speak with the commander alone. Of course, my lord. Please excuse me. Until next time, commander. As Sith, it is our nature to seek our own advancement. The Dark Council may have changed, but that drive remains. Victory on Corellia benefits us all. It advances us all. Should Lord Savick or any other council member forget their priorities in my absence, the Empress grants you leave to remind them. Some may need harsher reminders than others. Victory on Corellia is our only concern. Losses in pursuit of that goal are acceptable. Lord Savick awaits you. Farewell. Oh, excellent. We got to kill quite a few people. Come in, Lana. Our objective is Onderon. Take everyone we can spare. You'll be briefed on arrival. Understood. We'll depart for Onderon at once. <laughs> oh. There we go. And I can just launch. <laughs> This was like the longest expansion they'd released in a while as well. 
consists of about three planets, I think. Onderon, Mekshar, and Corellia. Welcome to Onderon. This is the royal hunting lodge of King Petra, the current ruler of the planet. Although Onderon is officially back the again, planet, King Petra is eager Welcome to sell back. his world's resources outside of that allegiance. Which is where the Empire comes in. Precisely. Darth Savick is exploiting the King's greed to turn him into an Imperial asset. But his noble council hasn't followed suit. We get to kill everyone. The throne, but the nobles have control of the capital city and day-to-day -day operations. If they learn of his imperial ties, he could be deposed. And what of the Republic fleet we're meant to destroy? Still gathering in orbit. They're preparing for refueling and resupply operations. Savik lacks the resources to attack the fleet directly. I believe she intends to use her control over Petrif instead. Um. Forget Savik. Call in our ships and order them to destroy the fleet. Simple. Commodore Pardax strongly advises against it. The Republic fleet is sizable. We would incur significant losses and couldn't guarantee total destruction of the enemy. Fuck. Shall we get started? I need to remember to summon a companion on this. I've been on this planet so many times and forgot a companion and then died because no one's healing me. There we go. Near. I'll show you all the ones that are dead. Here we go. These are all the companions that are dead. She's not dead. Dead, 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 dead. Doesn't exist anymore. Um, and that's it. Oh yeah. Why is Broomark not available? We didn't kill him. And Pierce. Pierce is unavailable as well. We didn't kill them. We killed Jason. We killed Quinn. Oh, there's like loads of side characters that are dead as well. No, hello. I was surprised to find you absent upon my return from the Senate, my king. Do you expect to visit the capital soon? I will return when it suits me. We have matters to discuss. When do you think it would suit you to return? You overstep, Senator. It is your job to share my decisions with the Republic, not to question them. Do not bother me again! Do not bother me again! The nobles meddling was bad enough without Nebet to stir them up further. This is intolerable. Am I not king? Do I not rule this world? They clearly don't respect your power, dear king. And to send the Senator back here. Perhaps the Republic believes you need more supervision. But you need not concern yourself. I have brought a powerful ally to ensure nothing comes of your enemy's plans. Allow me to introduce the Alliance Commander. It's already clear that you stand apart from the greatest and wisest rulers in the galaxy. <sighs> a truly special king. <laughs> ah, yes. Well, you're wise to see it so quickly. Welcome to my world. <sighs> Nebet's provocations have utterly drained me. A hearty meal laid in my recovery. Do enjoy your visits. Oh. Uh, goodbye then. <laughs> As you can see, the king all but eats from my hand. He is the key to our victory here. Onderon's capital is equipped with powerful defensive cannons that could easily destroy the Republic fleet in orbit. The cannons cannot be operated remotely, but... If we spur the king into a civil war against his nobles, the distraction will suffice. 
We will infiltrate the capital amid the chaos of battle. Seize control of the guns. And eradicate the Republic fleet before they even realize they're in danger. Petrov is too stupid to be reliable. I doubt he can make this happen for us. As long as we are here to guide him, he will do what's required. Petrov already suspects that his nobles are moving against him. We need to push that paranoia further. Oh. Through intermediaries, I have hired a band of mercenaries to infiltrate the hunting lodge and assassinate the king. <gasps> Fortunately, you will swoop in to defeat these deadly attackers just in time. You will save the king, earn his trust, and push him further from his nobles all at once. I'm not your lackey. Killing a few mercenaries? I have better things to do. It is certainly beneath your talents, but you must see the value in this sort of escalation. I want to kill this bitch. Petrif will be pushed over the edge. <laughs> I already have bloodlust. If my calculations are accurate, the mercenaries will arrive any moment now. I'll be happy to guide you to them over the comm. Good luck. Nobody better mess with us now. Honestly, she she is the worst one. Like she takes credit for everything. Um, we still haven't sold shit, have we? No. Oh no, we have sold. We have sold some stuff. Yeah, they could squeak. She literally makes herself look amazing. She's like, uh huh. I'm I'm such an it And she and at the end as well, she's like, Oh, I'll just take all the credit for this. But you can't kill her. Into the throne room. I I've tried several ways to try and kill her. I don't want to rank Dark Council. <laughs> nah, nah. <laughs> I get my own rank that's higher than theirs after this uh, mission, so I'm happy with that. I swear, I can... I don't know what... Oh, I think I have to come back here, actually. Hello! security stations all the way back here.
You're good to go. Avarilia, uh, is that Ava? Oh. Avaria, uh, welcome to the stream and thank you for the follow. I uh, hope you're doing well. What? What the heck? <laughs> There it is. We could help that guard. King Petrus, we are on route oh. to the throne room now. Good. Stop them and you'll be rewarded. Oh, I think those royal guards have got it. Yeet. Yeah, those guards have got it. <laughs> Oh, defeat the leader. Don't mind if I do. How? Why? Doesn't matter, you're dead now, bitch. <laughs> I take it the ruthless assassins have been dealt with. Now that the area has been secured, we can exit the safe room. Look, and she's just sat with him. Like, she could have defended him any point. Any point, she this could have made herself outrage. look good. They think they can kill me? Me! I am the king of Onderon! Once they realized your strength, Nibet and her Republic conspirators knew they could no longer hope to control you. Killing you was their only option. But I'm the king! Uh, yes. I have deployed my droids to defend the premises. I assure you that you're now quite safe. Good, good, excellent. Well done, yes. My king, what of your cousins? They're still at the ancient proving grounds. And? What do they have to do with any of this? It's possible they're in danger too, good king. If your enemies are attacking you, they could also target your family. <gasps> but the commander who valiantly saved your life can certainly rescue your cousins as well. Your enemies are clearly ruthless. It may already be too late, but I'll do what I can. Inconceivable! They have royal blood! I can't believe this. My blaster! I need my blaster! Ah, oh, where did I put it? <laughs> His gullibility exceeds even my greatest estimates. We have given him fear. Now. We must give him anger. Find the king's cousins at the ancient proving ground. Kill them. Then spread evidence that Nibet is to blame. Petrif will demand retribution, and we'll have our diversion. I seem to be doing all the work, Savik. When will you contribute to this mission? My talents are best devoted to control. Say, so she just doesn't do anything. For the eventual assault. She's her the Onderon wilds are treacherous. A lazy safe. You should take a guide with knowledge of the terrain. Speed is crucial. The Republic fleet is about to begin refueling, but my plan is unfolding perfectly. Victory will be ours. Oh, oh, we've just, <laughs> just randomly teleported. Oh, 
Ah, Commander. I believe I found a pair of local guides we can trust. Oh, look. Chikaro, C2D4. <laughs> Better than they treated us, clearly. We really need this. Yes, because he's got one arm. Find me someone else, Lana. These two will just slow me down. You've lost an arm. <laughs> the only other guides available are locals with strong ties either to Petrif or the capital. None of them can be trusted. Rest assured, you're in capable hands, Commander. Good luck. Ah, hands. <laughs> Feeling a bit we better We just now? need to pick up a few questionably legal items to ensure all goes to plan. Luckily, we've made exactly the right friends here. Right, Chikaro? <laughs> the delivery should be waiting for us. Do 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 do. Don't think I can mount yet, can I now? Now I can. What's this? Wait, what is this? Oh! know what that is, but we can look at that later. I th actually, I think I'm going to leave that one, because if I remember, it's it's bound, yeah, it's bounties for something, so I'm just going to leave it, if I remember right. So I'll leave it for now. Just focus on story stuff. These blasters were modified to look just like the nobilities, house insignias and all. Feeling a bit better now? I would do like all the bonus quests, but eh, not failing it. Damn it. There it is. Do these ID crests look a little flimsy to you? Well, at least that better. is the only person they have to fool. Now for the data pads. Our slicer friend promised they'll be full of authentic personal correspondences. <laughs> You pay for quality, Jakaro, and I had a good feeling about him. I'm an excellent judge of character. Here we go. To the proving grounds. All we have to do is cross a wilderness full of horrific, bloodthirsty beasts. <laughs> no problem for you, of course. Here we go. I honestly love like this expansion. I'm sorry to interrupt, but the king had a request he wished me to relay. If you my oasis is overrun by lizards. The Geo didn't warn me they'd reproduce like mad, and they're pushing out my favorite marks. They're ruining my hunts. Kill them. I'll do that for him. Kill them all. It's not a very uh, long bonus mission. Gets me some XP as well. Where are the eggs?
Why? Apparently I can't hit that one, so... Okay, that's weird. Ah. <laughs> uh. Say again. Nah, he's not back yet. Yeah. Yeah. Eggs. Where is eggs? Usually by the hatchlings. Yeah, I'll finish this mission and then I'll uh, I'll pause it, I think. And then uh give an end to today's stream. Uh, is there a wire back here? No, there isn't. I know, I know, it is sad. Eh, nah, not really. Two hours. Two hours is about my usual time. Oh, Renown rank up. Oh no, I fell. This is always a bastard getting off. Ugh. 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 Oh shit. Plus, uh, the frames are slowly increasing. <laughs> so, uh, usually when that happens, it's uh, time to come off. <laughs> Blasters are planted. Feeling a bit better now? Oh, hang on. Alright. <laughs>
Destru destroying. Oh, that was close. Hello. Not one step closer. Identify yourself. I don't talk to corpses. What? I don't understand. Ugh! I'm tired of all this nonsense. Let's go back to the capital. <laughs> Get down! For Onderon! You will not harm my wards! Your what? Your words? Silly man, I'm not touching your words. Well, I might cut your tongue down. My lady. Hmm, <laughs> and now we get to deal with two children. Lovely. How dare you! Our cousin is the king. I know, but I can't kill him yet, so your deaths will have to tide me over. You'll regret this! <laughs> Savik, Petrov's cousins are dead. Such a tragedy. I'll inform the king they were slain hours ago. Well done. Savik, out. Alright then. 
Return to Darth Savick. Don't mind if I do. Answer my mail as well. That's very important to do that. Oh, that was lucky. What have we got here? 201. Disintegrate. Go a bit there. Commander, good. The king is attempting to rally support for an invasion of the capital. Your efforts were beyond successful. Good. My plan unfolds precisely as scheduled. The king will rejoin us momentarily, having realized he lacks the military support to reclaim his palace. He will ramble about traitors, demand the blood of his enemies, and remind us yet again that he is king. Then, with the simplest prodding, he will realize where to acquire the troops he needs. We're wasting valuable time. Petrov is a useless idiot. Let's handle this ourselves. An idiot, yes, but not useless. I beg your patience. Hello. This is not my first operation of this kind. Trust me. All will unfold as I've calculated. Traitorous, cowardly, yeah, I want them all dead! The bet, the nobles, my worthless bannermen, the Republic, all of them! Dear King, surely your allies rallied to your cause. Some did, and they will receive a King's reward, but far too few. We cannot take the capital with such a small force. I only wish the Empire could provide more aid in these dark times. No one else on this world has the strength to challenge the nobles and their off-world comrades. It seems impossible to believe. Well. No. Onderon's strength is not yet lost. There is one group. They've hated the nobles for years. Tried to undermine all relations with off-worlders. I always dismiss them as backward and paranoid, but perhaps they were right all along. Uh, about the Republic, that is. They are known as the Untamed. Their leader is a beast lord, a Kuru. He's a keeper of Andoran's old ways, but he will not join us easily. Please, oh. King Petrif. If we cannot supply the troops you so badly need, at least allow us to win this ally for you. A Kuru and his untamed are proud and stubborn. They have no more love for me than the nobles. I'm not sure how you could secure their allegiance. These untamed can join our fight or die. I'm sure they'll make the right choice. You are a fierce an ally indeed. Your reward shall be great once my throne is reclaimed. I will prepare myself for war. Good fortune to you, friends. Mm -hmm. All too easy. The Untamed are Onderon's only other major group. Once they're weakened by joining this attack, they will pose no further threat to Imperial operations. <laughs> There is a proper way to seek an audience with them. An old ritual. They love old rituals. Excellent. And one more thing. I've learned that Akuru's elder brother, Brutan, Brutan. once trained as a Sith. He died Brutan. fighting Republic forces on Hoth. The rest of the Untamed aren't aware of Brutan's service. To leave Onderon and serve off-worlders would be abhorrent to them. Perhaps a useful bit of leverage over a Koru. My patience ends after this. We attack the Republic together, or I do it myself. Do we understand each other? We do. I assure you, with the untamed as shock troops, Onderon's defensive cannons will be ours to seize. The Republic fleet will be at our mercy. Yes. I must finish preparing my own droids for the assault. It is best if any Imperial identifying components are removed. Good luck. Yeah. 
Alright, there we go. So to end it, to end it, what I can do, what I can do, is, uh, let's go cartel market. Yeah, I'll just put hiding just a sec, just a sec. Just a sec. And... In a minute, I'll get some of these. So there we go. Mine. Back to here. Alright, so... Oops. Cartel market. When it all comes through. That's nice, that's decent armor. Popular. We'll be able to get this. So I'll just give it a couple of minutes. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Four. I'm gonna buy some packs. Oh, yeah, I can check my mail while I'll be white. My fire on. I owe you. And I have two pleasing results. Batman, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. What other games? Um, at the moment, what I kind of cycle in and out of, um, a bit of Skyrim. Um... Got this payment stack and a while to come through. Um, a bit of uh, Skyrim, a bit of. A bit of Skyrim, a bit of Shadow of War, uh, Ace Attorney as well. Those are the other three games that we're mostly doing. Here, I'll, I'll wait for this payment to. Might as well keep doing this. Make some edge wine. For next time. Is that better? Those are the major ones that we're uh, playing at the moment. Uh, I am key, and I will be playing Halo Infinite once it once it comes out. Uh, I'm going to avoid the beta for now. Is it all the main? Um, I'd say so. I kind of find myself coming back to this more than anything. What, oh, Halo Infinite? The new Halo. The new Halo. But this pipe, what is wrong with this pie, man? My PayPal seems to be really weird. In 
playing Final Fantasy a lot, and they wanted to get back into store. How's the game in 2021? Um, I'd say very good. That's what I'd say. Um, it's really holding up. For me, personally. Uh, it's still a good game to come back to. And all that. These coins have not come through yet. Give me a sec. Yeah, I'd definitely give it a ray download. I might not have done it. I have to say. Yeah, I would highly recommend it in 2021. Yes, that's what we are doing, is getting ready for it. It just seems so weird that it doesn't... Seems to like... Oh, now it's worked. Now it's worked. It didn't work the other time. I don't think I... <laughs> I might not have gone completely forward with it, which is odd. Um, there we go. There it comes in. So we'll buy that. Climb all. Just to end this off. Might as well, haven't we? Um, pack viewer. Shh. Oh, it's because it's in the inventory. Uh, yeah, there we go. Is that better? There we go. Pack explorer. There we go. Squadron. Um, no, but I might give it a go. Might give it a go. Yeah. That one's not a bad mount. That's a decent mount, there. Nice. But yeah, I would definitely... Ooh. That's nice. Like that. Shut that door. <laughs> Caracas. Oh, that's a nice mount as well. Light blue, medium red. Blizz customization. I want some nice armors. That's what I'd like. Or mounts. These are decent as well. I would really like an Akli. An Akli mount. Marshall and the Ambusher. Concealed bodysuit armor set. Ooh, Primeval Stalker armor set. That's pretty decent. Marker Ragnos armor set. Nice. We 
We've got loads of armor sets. Ooh. Nice. Black Volcar Swooper set. Nice. I like that. Fool Statesman. I know. Some uh, very decent stuff. These aren't. <laughs> that was a bad pack. Bad pack. Pretty naff pack as well. Cybernetic armor set, we've got that one. Oh! Spectre armor set. Nice. Alright, more packs. Hmm. Bit of a math pack. That one's not a bad weapon. Dark blue and deep red die module. I like the sound of it. I like the sound of it. Minus wasp. Mantelli. Oh, those two aren't bad. Send the ties. Oh, look at this. Dark Legionnaire's armor set. Now I want to. I want to keep some of the dies. I want to keep some of the dies. <laughs> Do you know Star Citizen? A little bit, not a lot. Last pack. Let's see what it is. Shit. <laughs> right. Okay then, so that will end us, I think. That will end us, I believe. We've uh, come a long way. So yeah, uh, let's just see if there's anyone to raid. There's Ben. If people fancy uh, some Pokemon. So yes, that'll wrap up today's stream. Um, probably not going to stream till Tuesday now. I'm at work tomorrow. Sunday looks like it's going to be very, very busy. Monday I'm going to be starting my production. So, got to do all the performance stuff on Monday. But yes feel like that is us so yes so thank you all for watching uh, thank you to everyone who followed today as well which is very decent and yeah we shall raid Ben now uh, no worries Grizzly um, it has been a blast Uh, yeah, it was quite fun today, actually. We got a lot of stuff done. New, another expansion started. We've nearly completed all the expansions now. And then I can move on to my Imperial Agent character. And then when the new expansion comes out, I'm going to have to do a stream where I just go through every single character that I've got. Because <laughs> it's quite a lot. <laughs> Yes, um, so that'll wrap us up. So again, thank you everyone to watching. Been very, very fun. And yes, I hope you all have a pleasant evening. But for now, bye-bye.